Yeah, it, it really is. Um, and they're gentlemaning probably to Smashville, knowing these two. Mm -hmm. Because uh, Medic doesn't want to ban, because banning is a hard thing to do in this, because he's got to... He's gonna. He it's might end up choosing between Battlefield and Dreamland, depending on the way things go, because he's got a. His bands are going to be Dreamland and Battlefield, but that leaves Z with the advantage of picking either Smashville, Town and City, or yeah. FD. I was gonna starter. say it doesn't matter which two stages you leave. Rosalina has an advantage on like yeah. six of the stages, six of the seven legal stages. He can't choose Duck Hunt, so. Yeah. No, we're only going. No, it's. I was talking about starter stages. Yeah, leaves, absolutely. That's what. That's why I meant when I yeah, said he can't choose Duck Hunt. Medic's going to have to leave Smashville and Town and City, so it's easier to just gentlemen to Town and City. Or the Smash World, then go into Town City. Oh, absolutely. Uh, unless he really wants to go for that dangerous thing instead and uh, ban those two first. God, no, because that leaves the t uh, the three platform stages. And even though Mario can get up air shenanigans, I think he'd rather not get up aired by Rosa. Oh yeah. You never Ooh. know. You never know though with banning. They could have. They could end up on Final Destination by some magic. Well, no, it's because Medic's bands are going to be Dreamland and Battlefield. Like, there's nothing. He's not. He's. Those are his definite bands. So it really boils down to which stage do, does Z want to play on most. Like, Z kind of controls it by virtue of his character having the better stages, or having the more immediate uh, good stages. Ooh, the dash attack to cover the uh, snap to ledge. Not for me. Ketchup and mustard. Oh man, my foot's falling asleep. Oh no, this is weird. Um, although Z's got a uh, Z's at a percent deficit, but thanks to the nature of his character, now his up airs are going to do a lot more uh, knockback, and Luma's going to do even more knockback than he already does. Luma's the real MVP. Yeah. Um, and also he's just got to fight more for stage control. It's one of the things I've liked about Z is that he started taking advantage of his position a lot more recently. Oh I've yeah. Noticed. And, and and Medic just gets that first stock yeah. though with that. Medic gets with that first stock with that raw up smash, but that's also Mario. Um. That's one of the things that I like about Mario as a character is that uh, you have to have a little bit of reading in you. You have to really know how to read people. Yeah. Nothing's like truly guaranteed with Mario, even the quasi-guaranteed stuff, because you can DI it at later percents, and those are percent those percents where it matters. So, ooh, he tries to approach with bit dare and gets grabbed for his trouble. And Z, I like how Z's playing off stage more. He's really forcing Medic to snap to ledge, because on the off chance Medic somehow mistimes his up B, that's a kill. Like there. Like, Medic purposely went for the up B early to clip Z because Z put himself a little too low. But in a lot of situations, that would have been really a really good just clean up, up smash. Oh, yeah. A really absolutely. good clean uh, there. Yes. Yes, Tyler, it was. Um, Tyler's asking about scores real quick because he's submitting the bracket. And, um, yeah. And one of the things Medic, I like about Medic is he's playing at Z's range really effectively because Z's, like, you can tell Z was facing about to try to reach for grabs and stuff there. Got the back throw finally, but it wasn't quite enough because he's only sitting on 47%. Um, and uh, Medic's just like, I'm respecting the range you want to play at, and I'll just throw fireballs and I'll wait. I got time. We got three minutes. They got three minutes. Um, it definitely Ooh, gets hit by the jab. And uh, that's the stock. And he runs in with the dare. That's a little dangerous, but it's uh, good hits on shield. Ooh, up smashes, uh, up smashes uh, Luma. And Luma extending the hitbox enough for Z to get into shield, which is also... Uh, one of the nicer things about having Luma in those interactions. Oh, absolutely. Dash attacks Luma to take care of him, and now he's got eight seconds to try to do something. And can he make it work? Uh, Z is uh, backing off. He's waiting for his Luma. Um, ooh, goes for the grab there. Can't quite get it. Dash attack. Ooh, that was an up air. Um, although I do like how Z waited and chilled there. Oh, no. Luma gets taken out again. Z can still bring this back, though. He's just got to... Um, He's just got to play a little better at the range he's playing at and really start uh, trying to... I guess maybe would eating Mario's fireballs be worth in this scenario? Because I feel like Mario's a little no. too fast. No, absolutely not. Like Mario's a little too fast for um, the range they're playing at for fireballs to really be worth eating. Yeah, yeah, absolutely. Or gravitational pulling. That's what I'm trying to say. I forgot the word for a second. And that's they just take it after uh, shielding a uh, cross-up dash attack. Yeah, absolutely. And while F-Smash at that set point in the stage, it was just uh, curtains. All right. So what we're going to see here is a savage counter pick, mm -hmm. right? Uh, it's like Z's going to switch to Zelda. <laughs> my boy, my dude. Why? Why would you <laughs> why would you even joke about that? That hurts my soul. I hear if you pop the balloon a million times that uh, you get Ridley as a character in the game. Yeah. Yeah. That's, yeah, it's um there's a hidden counter. You have to go into the game's code to really see where you're at. 
I'm playing doubles right now. Okay, I got you. All right, so I guess I'm by myself for now. Joining us is going to be SMS's Honor. SMS Honor here. How's it going? It's going good. Not so much for Z, but for me it is. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Z's at a disadvantage. Yeah, no. Um, oh, wait. No. Dude, Meta gets Z. My bad. <laughs> um. Z, well, Z okay. haven't struggled that first game. This is going to be Z's chance to bring it back. If Medic plays a very solid Mario game, he can definitely capitalize on these platforms and get early kills. Uh, but Z can do the same. Oh, yeah. This game can dictate a lot of the momentum for the rest of the match. Absolutely. Um, especially if one of the characters, like Medic, feels demoralized after that SD. Right. Because a lot of people don't realize how important like mind games are. Right, this is a strong two stock. We can see Medic like lose a little bit, but like, I don't feel like Medic's the type of player who could really lose steam like that. Oh like, yeah, no, he's very mentally strong. Yeah, I've seen him win many a game five. Medic has a very intense. This is and this is just going to be a best of two though, so or best of three, first to two, however you want to call that, oh. because we're not quite at losers finals. This is losers semis. Okay. So we got. So if Medic gets, uh, if Ziad takes this one, he's got uh, one more game to win, and then he'll be in. And the same thing for Medic. Uh, if he beats this, comes out of nowhere, he, he's just going to take it. I mean, it's still anyone's game. If, oh, okay. <laughs> I'm, I definitely I'm, think that that 96% extra credit is just going to mean the end of it for uh for Medic because even at grabs it's a dangerous game to play right. because Luma's just going to pop him out of those unless he gets the perfect timing on that. Oh yeah. I mean, but you never know. He could go Super Saiyan. Oh yeah, absolutely. If he goes like hard... Things that yeah. He's got to get strings though if he wants that. Right. Strong reads, good strings. I think that's going to be it for Rosalina Stock. Oh, no, no, no. Uh, Z's still living. He wants this two stock. Change his name to Z I. <laughs> <laughs> Z Ad the D Ad. I don't know if that works. Yeah, whatever works, works. That was almost funny. But, Medic here with that back throw. Not going to kill because it's stale. Uh, I was kind of hoping Luma was going to go over the edge there. Ooh, solid tech. A very dangerous game for him to be playing with that recovery. Can mix up which direction he's rolling really easily, though, um, oh, because he disappears. First, first stock. He's got 124% deficit. Uh, up tilt from Luma will kill. Uh, right now, all Z is or Z is looking for is just is just a solid uh, mistake. Any. All he needs is a couple frames, and that's that's the end of game. It's not a likely win for Medic, but it isn't like exactly unwinnable. Oh yeah, but, but Mario takes out Luma so easily. Zed's just gonna Z's just gonna wait for that Luma to get out of there. Um, he's got 13 seconds to wait. Um, oh oh no, that solid DI that could have killed. We saw red lightning. Oh yeah. Um, I think this is really gonna dictate like the momentum for the next game because if like. Anthony has a really solid stock. Even if he loses this, he was still coming back from a huge deficit. Oh, absolutely. You know, and if they're both too defensive, Ziad might just take this uh, by time. If he has to. That's a possibility. It's a possibility. Nothing wrong with Chris G's. They, we respect oh. him. He should have just gone for the up air or up tilt there underneath the stage. It might not have killed, but it, it would have definitely been worth it. Uh, Mario getting close to maximum reach here. Oh, yeah. Um... It's it. I don't want to say it's anyone's game because I feel like the second I do, commentator's curse kicks in and someone's going to die. Oh, yeah. But really, it's getting close to that point. Oh, yeah. Um, Medic has a very solid advantage. And this might mentally this might mentally uh, take a toll on either of these players. Uh, Rosalina's light, so this is, they're both in kill for some. That's not going to kill, though. Right. Rosalina doesn't have kill throws. Um, Can't just be tossing people. Yeah. Duo! Duo! Oh! Oh! Oh, is this happening? Oh my god! Don't let him back on stage. All he needs now is that throw, though. That throw will kill. Oh, yeah. That's 
They got one minute left. If and you, Anthony oh. takes. No. Oh. Zia takes game two. Going on to game three. A definite statement was made there. A, a definite statement was. Yes, absolutely. Um, this is going to be highly in Z's disadvantage because now Medic gets the stage of his choice. You're right. Which means he won't be able to platform camp because, I mean, triple platform stages usually favor Rosalina. Oh, yeah, absolutely. But at the same time, um, they give Mario combo potential. Right. So it's really, it's really dependent on how Ziad plays this match. I'm expecting a town and city switch. Um... No, I think it's probably going to be Final Destination or Duck Hunt. But, I, you know, I might be wrong, but I feel like uh, Town and City gives uh, Rosalina some savage gimps. Or not oh, yeah. gimps, but savage early kills. And she kills off the top early. Oh, yeah. Absolutely. Um, Mario might be taking... I think, I think we're taking it to... Oh, no. Not Final Destination. I don't think Nettick's going to go up to... I just don't see him as that player to do that. But as a Mario player, it, it very well could uh, go either way with that. Right. He's hovering over Duck Hunt, though. I think he might have a solid like hypothesis there. <laughs> I think I think he's just thinking it through, trying to trying to look at the stage, get a feel for what could go wrong on it. Yeah. Uh, because with Duck Hunt, if he lands, like gets knocked up onto one of those platforms and lands poorly, that's yeah. end. So we're now at we're now at uh, Duck Hunt. Uh, Ziad's got to Ziad's got to stretch this one out. Got to get uh, the best of his build, like pull out his best. Oh yeah, and Duck Hunt's a good stage for any character in the wall jump. So I mean, thanks boosting his dog. Favorite. Dog helping him out right there, saving him for Mario. I don't particularly like this pick against Rosalina personally, just because like she can cover so much space. Oh, absolutely. With a uh, well spaced Luma, she gets like a quarter of the stage easily. And it's such a large stage, so getting in becomes a little tougher. Yeah, absolutely. Um, she can camp in the top of the trees and just move because uh, because of how floaty she is. That's one dead duck, though. Oh yeah, absolutely. Now, long we can get the dead lumas. Oh yeah, absolutely. We got a thousand points from Mario. Um, so he's winning. He's yeah, he's winning. Obviously, um, Rosalina having the chance to get that duck, but just totally flubs. Oh yeah. Absolutely. This dog is going to come up laughing. This is really a pathetic display. Exactly. Of duck hunt prowess. I love it when people play the duck hunt dog and then uh, then the duck hunt dog screws them over because it comes up laughing on top of the duck hunt dog. I'm not going to lie. If they stop in the middle of the set to just play duck hunt for a little bit, like I'd be ecstatic. Like I would be laughing. Oh yeah, absolutely. Too hard to commentate. No, that that'd be. But we all know that people can't actually have fun inside these. Oh, yeah. He can't have fun in place. Oh, he's going for it. Oh. He reaches and he takes it. That was to about, the, what, 50%? Yep. That to was the a, heavens. Rosalina just got reunited with the galaxies. Yeah, it's playing a very defensive game. He knows what he's up against. He's oh, going to yeah. take he advantage of that. that. Or you know, I have my I have my food given to me before all of it's gone. Exactly, because these people are savages, man. Vultures. I remember uh, yesterday they were uh, they had were serving spaghetti, and I found out about it, and not like five minutes later, that was completely empty. I hear that somebody licked all the sauce out of the bowl too. No, I'm kidding. Oh, but. Savage. Both of them are at one stock. Z, Z definitely has the potential to take this back with a couple of hits. But if if Mario has this, he's going he, he's he's going for that Luma. Does, okay. does not get it. He wants to disarm Z before they even have an exchange. And that's a real mental game too, is knowing when to go for the Luma and when to go for Rosalina. Well, the answer is separate them and always go for Luma first. Right. Because Rosalina without Luma is well, just Rosalina. Yeah, which is and she's, she takes her down like five tiers. As as an individual, like she's not a bad character, she's still better than Zelda. Because right. her frame data is still pretty good, has an awesome down tilt, but But is she better than Peach without Luma? That's the question. Is she a lower tier princess? No, no, she's just without Luma without Luma, she's not even good enough to be your waifu. Not even waifu material without Luma. 
Not even waifu material. Luma's the one who does the cooking and cleaning. 